When you accomplish certain things for the first time in school history, such as earning the first Heisman, winning six SEC titles, and the first ever national championship in school history, you absolutely deserve a day to be recognized here at the University of Florida. That's exactly what happened with head ball coach Steve Spurrier. Please welcome Coach Steve Spurrier. Well, it's been a special day, everything. Uh, we had a nice reception, a lot of family, all my uh, children, grandchildren, a lot of them were here. It's the biggest honor I've ever received in my life, so it's been a really big special day. I know, I can sense how special this is to him. He's not just saying the right things, I mean, he's really touched, and it's it's fun to see him moved. He's so happy, you know, and, and if, you, if you said it to him, you say, Coach, you know, you're so happy, he said, oh, I'm, I've always been happy, but you know, it's like, he deserves all this. I mean, he, he built all of this. This is all because of him. The Swamp now known officially and forever as Steve Spurrier, Florida Field, and the timing couldn't be better. I have been very fortunate and blessed since becoming a Florida Gator to receive several honors and awards. But I can assure all of you here today, having my name next to Florida Field, Ben Hill Griffin Stadium, here in the Swamp, is the single biggest honor I'll ever receive. Thanks. A perfect night in the perfect place. Didn't stop there for Coach Spurrier as he had the opportunity to conduct Mr. Two Bits. I tried to do that Usain Bolt pull the air thing. I don't know if many people saw it. It had, it had a big crowd around me. I don't know if they could see that. But anyway, I, a, a few people saw it. He told me in the tunnel right before he went out too, he goes, I said, you ready for two bits? He goes, yeah. He goes, I got something for him, too, because I got a surprise. And so I'm like, what is he going to do? And I guess it was Usain Bolt. I didn't realize that's what he was doing. I thought maybe he was shooting a bow and arrow or something like the kids do. On the 20th anniversary of his team's national championship run, the head ball coach was once again hoisted high in the air as he wrapped up a special, special night. That was, uh, that was a team that was really, really special. But we had some really good breaks. After we lost at FSU, we had to have four teams lose, and, and then we beat FSU in the rematch. So, but as far as the team really ready to play, that Gator team with the rematch with Simmons, that, that was a special one. You know, you stay in touch with some, but there's just so many guys sort of come back together, and you see all these, these guys that you have so many special memories with, and, and a lot of us had our kids out there, which just made it even more special, and uh, it was a great, great night. For plenty more information on the head ball coach and the 2016 Florida Gators, head on over to FloridaGators.com today. For Gator Vision, I'm Mitch Gerber.